All right, guys, welcome back to another video from golfcartstuff.com. This video, all about easy go wheels and tires. So you may have yourself an easy go golf cart and you're thinking, man, I'd love to put some new wheels and tires on that thing, but I don't know what size will work. Well, we're gonna answer that for you today. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna start at the bottom and we're gonna work our way all the way up to the top. And we're gonna talk about sizing, we're gonna talk about when you need a lift kit, what size, we're gonna get all those questions answered for your easy go golf cart. So let's head on down to the bottom at 18 inches and get started. All right guys, so this will be pretty simple for easy go. Um, you know, if you've got a stock easy go golf cart and you hit the stock wheels and tires, those are gonna be about 18 inches in overall height. You can just pop those bad boys off. And if you look at a wheel and tire combo, and again, we're measuring from bottom of the tire to top of the tire with the wheel and tire combo inflated together. Um, anything 18 to 18 and a half inches, you guys can just take those old ones off, put these new ones on. Guys, a lot of times people don't think that they can get off-road tread with their non-lifted cart. But we've got some combos here. Obviously, these are about 18, 18 and a half inches. We've also got our street tread as well um, with an eight inch, 10 inch, 12 inch wheel. Again, 18, 18 and a half inches in overall height, easy go golf cart, no problem. Get your old ones off, put the new ones on. So moving on up, we're talking 20 inches now. So if you're looking at a combo that's about 20 inches in overall diameter, again, that's the wheel and the tire put together. I got more great news for you. Easy Go Golf Carts, you guys have some awesome wheel wells. So if you got an Easy Go Golf Cart, 20 inch wheel and tire combo, guess what? No lift kit. Take your old ones off, put these on. You're still not gonna have any rubbing, even with that increased uh, wheel and tire size, no problem at all. Works on an Easy Go Golf Cart. No issues, all right? So we got the 18, we got the 20. Now let's talk about 22 inches, all right? When you get in 22 inches, you're gonna need a lift kit, all right? Now you're starting to get in some big tire territory. So again, I wanna show you, you got multiple tread options. So you're not stuck. You've got, you know, street, you've got off-road. Okay, you've got those options for you. 22 inches in overall height, you're gonna need a three inch lift kit with an easy go. So whether that's a TXT or an RXV, whatever the case, three inch lift kit, you can get 22 inch wheel and tire combos on there. No problem at all uh, with that three inch lift kit. Um, you'll be ready to rock and roll. And last but not least, we got the big boys. So these are the 23 inch um, overall height combos, just about as big as you can get on a golf cart wheel and tire. Most people don't make anything bigger. So 23 inches in overall height with the wheel and the tire. And uh, with this one, you're probably safest bet. You can probably get away with a five inch, but honestly, for most people we recommend just get a six inch lift kit. So um, with a six inch lift kit, you're not gonna have to worry about poor leaf springs or anything like that. It's gonna give you plenty of clearance. You get a six inch lift kit, you can get some real aggressive all-terrain tread. You can get a pretty thick um, you know, street tread with that as well. No problem. Again, six inches for a 23 inch overall height combination um, and you'll be ready to rock and roll. So guys, hopefully at this point, you have thought to yourself, that is everything I need to know about EasyGo wheels and tires. I feel so confident buying a new set of wheels and tires for my EasyGo golf cart. And if you feel that way, our goal has been accomplished. So guys, make sure you like and subscribe to our channel. We got plenty more videos coming out. Some are gonna be informational, some are gonna be fun, and all of them are gonna be both. So we'll see you next time, golfcarstuff.com. All right guys, so I know I literally just got done telling you about the 23 inch tires being about as big as you can go, but we just got some new product in the warehouse. So these are the Kenda Terra Tracks. Okay, so these measure in at 25, 10, 12. So that's a 12 inch wheel. Now the, this combo, when it's all inflated and aired together, this measures out about 25 inches in overall height. So this is literally the biggest you can go. Now we've got ourselves an old TXT cart in here that we're redoing our project cart. So keep in mind, for these wheel and tire combos, you are gonna need a six inch lift kit on your easy go. There's no going down underneath that. You're gonna need a six inch lift kit. Now we were putting these on here. We still had a little bit of rubbing when we were turning the wheel, um, but we're gonna get some wheel spacers on there. You get a six inch lift kit, you get some wheel spacers on your easy go. Uh, you're not going to have any problem. These are about as aggressive as they can get. You got about six inches of sidewall height there. So uh, we're pretty excited about these. These are real aggressive. So if you want to go big, big dog style, these are the way to go. So again, Kenda Terra Tracks, 25 inches in overall height. Um, you're good to go. 